afternoon. I'm Nicole Somavilla. The new news is breaking news, and this story comes out of the city of Syracuse. PSLA at Fowler High School is on lockdown right now after a student was stabbed at school. Our Andrew Donovan is outside the school at this hour. Andrew, what do we know right now? Well, Nicole, the police are working under the impression and the understanding that this teenager was stabbed inside school here at PSLA at Fowler about a couple of hours ago. So you see all the police here trying to investigate what happened. The student who was hurt was taken to the hospital. That person is still alive, we're told, but the condition is not known at this time. We're told that person is undergoing some sort of emergency medical treatment right now. But what's happening here at the school is that we're told a lockdown is in place. That means students cannot leave their classrooms and people also aren't allowed in. There's a lot of parents right now gathered trying to get information about their kids, trying to communicate with their kids. Those parents aren't being allowed inside the building. The students aren't being allowed outside the building. We actually heard a teacher communicating with parents from a, a higher up window saying that for the past few hours, the classes haven't even been allowed to leave the classroom. So they're sitting in the same class that they uh, were in when this stabbing happened. Police really don't have more information than that right now, but they do say they don't believe there's an ongoing or active threat, which to me means they may have the people or person responsible accounted for and, and maybe already speaking with that person. But police haven't confirmed if any arrests are made, if any suspects are in custody. They promised some... Uh, Updates pretty quickly is the words that were used that they expect this investigation to go quickly. But right now, the bigger scene right now is this communication between parents and, and the school administrators inside. Right now, uh, parents just want some information, and right now, police are working their hardest to get it. Live in Syracuse, Andrew Donovan, News Channel 9. All right, Andrew, thank you. We'll be following.